Hi everybody. Happy Mother's Day. So we're here with a box opening. This is my other baby that I said I was getting. So and this is a little boy. So we're going to start. I'm going to open it with you. Right. We already took the name, the addresses and names off of the box, so. I'm so excited. Okay, let's go slow. Don't rip it up, because we can use this tissue paper, can't we, for other yeah. things. Yeah. We always use tissue paper over. Thank you, Mommy. Thank you. Hold up one second, and we'll lift the baby up out of the box. I can help you. He is inside of a box, inside of a bag. He's got some presents. Okay, we're going to take this box and set it over to the side. Mm-hmm. Like again, like last time. Then we're going to wrap it and I'll open it. I was going to say. This is going to be fun, Mommy. This is going to take us a little bit longer than most ones because he's real wrapped up, real good, tied up in a bag. This person wrapped it up real, real nice. Yeah. And let's see the paint in the one here. He's got paperwork on him. Let's see if it's... Let's check to see if it ain't got no pictures. That's good. So, on here is his care instructions. And he's got a birth certificate. And his name is um Liam. Liam, but we are changing his name to his name. I'll tell you his name when I get him out. But it's got his birth certificate and his care instructions there. Let me see. And um, he was born on 5-30-2011 um, at 7-15 p.m. And he's 3 pounds, 2 ounces, and he's 17 inches long. So, we're going to get into the bag. We're going to get his goodies here first. Oh, I've never see seen goodies for, um, for her. Um, some baby in a little baggie, and, and it's a little outfit. It has trucks and cars all over. Oh, can I see? And it says "Scoop wow. me up" on it. See, it says "Scoop me up." And this is tiny. This is this is a preemie because he is a preemie. So we're gonna set that. We'll take this and set it back in the box. I was box just looking at the box. Um, that um, then we're gonna take the baby. Okay, let me see if I can move this up and move it down just a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Be careful not to bump it. So we're I'm we're just going to fully met, and you take the bag. Take the bag, honey. I'm okay, putting it in the box. Figure out where I think his head's down here, and these feel like his feet. Okay, so I'm gonna untie him. I tie them, and once. I'm going to be and careful because I don't know if his head, his head is not covered. So, what I'm going to do is like I did last night with the baby last night. I'm going to hold him up. Hold him up. And flip the blanket up over its head. I'm just looking at this. I'm going to start down at his little toes. My pills. favorite part. My oh, favorite part. His little foot. Yeah. Yes. Another beautiful model baby. Again. Yep. Again. Yep. 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 I want to see like this. Just like Ellie Mae is very, very beautiful. Yeah. Model. I'm not putting in the finger. But with Ellie Mae, Brian can't say Ellie Mae, so he calls her. What do you call Ellie Mae, buddy? Um. You call her May. She, Brian May. calls her May because he can't say Ellie. He always forgets the Ellie at the front. So yeah, Ellie I told May. him it's okay. Summer. That he, yep, Ellie May Summer is her name. Like and one Henry Henry Monster. So Brian just calls her May because it's easy for him to remember. Or Summer Hunter Monster. So we're undressing him. He's got a little, little. Let's not cover his head. Uncover his head yet. Uh -huh. I'm just uncovering it, taking his clothes off. He has a little sleeper that I'm, well, it's like a jumper. And then I'm taking that off. It's almost like a beach game. Beach. Yeah, on, on the, um, his shirt's got ball. And this is just a plain blue romper. And that was a preemie. 
Look at the hands. They're beautiful. Watch his head, honey. I'm watching his head. I'm hoping you guys are seeing this. I'm going to try to dip him up here a little bit. Beautiful modeling. And he's like the artist because I talked to the art, um, the lady that um, I got him that, that he was ordered from. And she said in areas that he, which I can see now, there he's like glossed in areas, like on his, on his, like his knees to make his knees look shiny. It's how the artist did it to make him look more realistic. So she put, they put like gloss on his top of his hands, and I see a little bit of like on the knees and everything. So let's go ahead and take, honey. Um, why don't you go and get me a one of. You can give me your Elmo blanket for I can put behind him and tuck him and get him up higher. Because right. I'm trying to keep him in front of the um, camera. I'm big and strong. <laughs> yeah, you are big and strong. Okay. Here you go. Thank you for letting me use your Elmo blanket. I'm going to put it behind him and kind of tuck him up here. There we go. I That's see it. good. Does he, you can see him real good in the yeah, camera now? Yeah, okay. I see it right here. So I'm going to put this, this onesie off of him, which this onesie has balls. just like little toys and balls on it. And he has a white onesie under, underneath that. So this lady did dress him really, really nice. Yeah, like beautiful on a um, first baby. So. I'm going to not strip him down any farther than that. All right. That's as far as I'm going to strip him down. All right. So. I can see this one. So. Really, really, he's got some veining up there. He's got some veining back there. It's really nice. His fingernails are really nice. So. So, are we ready for his face? Mm hmm Here we go. I want to look at it. Oh, he is so cute. Hey, buddy. This is a little I'm boy. So, uh, he has a little hat on. Like the um, um the big girl. Like last time. I, he is the key line. I think I'm saying it right. By um Denise Pratt. Kid. So. And ready for seeing his hair? Oh. Ready? Here we go. <gasps> Look at his light little brown hair. They're kind of like Brian's hair. It's really, really Lucky. soft. Yep. His hair is about the color of Brian's. He what? is really, really cute. He is so cute. He, he is awesome. And he's got the moisture looking face. And, um, they, I was told there is a little teeny tiny. I don't know if, if the camera's going to pick it up. There's a little teeny tiny white spot on his nose. And I was told that it was something the artist did for realisticness. I mean, it's supposed to be a white spot. I'm like, okay. It don't look like a milk bubble to me, but... Because milk bubbles are smaller than that. But he's cute. It just, just looks like me. I don't know. It, I thought, it kind of, looking at it and seeing it out now, it kind of looks like a rub mark, but the artist said it was something to do with realisticness. I was like, okay. And I said, well, I'll see when I get him. And I mean, I see him, he is adorable. And he, he's real floppy. You can see. He needs his head definitely supported. But this is little baby Nicholas. Nicholas. We'll, call, we'll call him Nick for short, or Nicholas, whatever, oh. whatever we say at the moment. But everybody, here's baby Nick, Nicholas. So I think um, I got a few things I want to show you that Brian gave me for Mother's Day, oh, along yeah. with the baby. Let me show. Along with baby Nicholas. And let me show this first. So first, he got me. Okay. This little cup. It says to mom, a cup of tea to say thank you for all the things you have done, and wish that the day will bring you happiness and fun. Happy Mother's Day, love, George. Because Brian's first name is George, but he goes by his middle name, which is Brian. Can so, you turn the and back? when you open it, 
well, you could flip it around and you'll see the teapot that he had colored. It has a little burn and sun and some flowers down it. Then you open it up from the top and it has a little packet of tea. If I can make a cup, cup of hot tea. I dropped it. Brian's picking it up for me. And I can make a cup of hot tea. And can then he made me this Mexico. paper. This is another, he said it's a Mother's Day card. We're not going to read it all. It's a whole bunch. It's saying it's basically top ten reasons why I love my mom because, and like the first one he has, because she reads to me and different, diff and helps him, and one of them is helping to bed and everything. So we're not going to sit and read all over them and everything because we already read them. But we're going to, he got me that too. So now he's going to show you a few things, and I'm, while he's showing you the few things, I'm going to pick up baby Nicholas and hold him. Um, can I tell you so something ahead, about honey. my classroom? Go ahead and tell um, what you want to tell. Um, I, um, there, um, Jason, uh, it's not coming over, maybe tomorrow or next Saturday, he has a friend named Nick, uh, Nick, he, Nick Ball, then I can show my stuff. Nick. Like Nick. Nick. Um, I think he's going to show you a few things he's got. He I'm going to move it back a little bit for you can see Here it. is Plato. He is my best friend. And um, I love him because he's a nug. Okay. So we're going to have to say goodbye now because my battery is going dead. So bye, everybody. Say bye, bye buddy. Bye, everybody. Okay, we're going to come back with a quick, quick little part okay. here. I know we just ended, but um, Brian wants to show his last little thing, so hopefully my battery don't die on me. So go ahead, buddy. Hurry uh, up. Here's my meter, and it flash, and um, um, it talks. It's a flashlight, and it talks. And here's Jumper's I, I love him like Pluto, and he is the snuggiest. Yeah, baby Nicholas truck. is still sitting here with us. And here we just is... Um, Master truck here is cool. I got it for Christmas, I think. And then my last thing is my um shaky thing, like it goes fast to the can, like this is like the queen. So So that's it. Bye. We did he get did get to get his stuff in real quick. And like I said, I'm gonna show you one last little shot. Here's little Nicholas. He is so cute. And Brian's gonna help me get him dressed and everything. So bye, bye everybody. everybody.